Office of Scientific Research manages the basic research investment for the U.S. Air Force. We discover, shape, and champion basic science that has major impacts on future Air Force. Today we travel to Harvard University, where AFOSR funded researcher Professor Lena Howe has demonstrated a way to not just slow the speed of light, she can bring it to a complete stop. This could have major impacts on supercomputing and communications in the future. This is a completely new paradigm for very po powerful processing of optical information. And this process here is the only way by which you can turn light into matter and back into light without losing any information. This could have major impacts on the Air Force of the future by allowing us to communicate using only light technology to protect vital information. Among other things, stopping light might provide a way to store data in future optical computers or lead to new ways to manipulate light. This may seem like magic without understanding the science behind it, but Professor Howe's secret is that she is stretching the laws of quantum mechanics. So our slow light research, what we do is we cool atoms to, first of all, to really low temperatures. We use lasers to do that. Uh, we cool atoms to a few millionth, actually to a few billionths of a degree above absolute zero, and create in our vacuum chamber the coldest place in the universe. Professor Howe then illuminates the extremely cold atom cloud with one laser beam and creates what is called an absorption cloud with this second laser beam. When we now send a laser pulse in, we send it in from this direction in through the atom cloud, we can now slow this laser pulse down to the speed of a bicycle. She can slow light so dramatically in a very small atom cloud that it actually stops. She can extinguish the stop light pulse and re-illuminate it in a completely separate location. But the information that was in the light pulse is not lost because that was already that imprinted in the atom cloud by that light pulse. It creates like a little hologram in the atoms. And that hologram stays when, when the light pulse turns off. And then when we later unblock the uh, uh, control laser, we can get that light pulse to regenerate and then just move on. Since its creation in 1951, AFOSR has funded top researchers in the fields of communications and sensing and continues to fund the pioneering works of revolutionary researchers like Professor Lena Howe. To learn more about communications and sensing breakthroughs funded by AFOSR, please visit our website at www.afosr.af.mil or visit us on Facebook and Twitter.